5 Tips Building Space Stations Number 1. Planning Each space station is unique in construction and style. While you can just start throwing spacecraft into orbit, it often pays off to spend a little time thinking ahead. With the addition of subassemblies, a new style is constructing the station in the vehicle assembly building and pruning off modules. It can be helpful to sketch a rough draft for consistency, or recreate key intersections in the vehicle assembly builder, ensuring the compatibility of new modules. Number 2. Station Core Every station has a first piece. As everything grows from the core, be sure to take care including enough docking ports, and a probe brain or pod to control from and name your station. Station cores can vary in many ways, but it's generally important to be aware of the center of mass, which can be noted in flight by where the camera is centered on your vehicle. Number 3. Space Junk Be cautious of boosters left in orbit. While they do pose a hazard to spacecraft, more importantly they slow down the game. Loading in these parts while they fly past your station can strain your frame rate. You can find and delete your boosters in the tracking station, or you can include probe brains and fuel for deorbiting your delivery vehicles. Number 4. Delivery For constructing your station, you're going to need a reliable heavy launch vehicle. Keep it as a subassembly to use launching your modules. You can build each module with its own controlling probe and thrusters, or you can keep unnecessary components on the delivery vehicle. This can help with a modest part count and a high frame rate. Number 5. Aligning Modules it's important to have an even push from RCS thrusters in every direction, evenly distributed around your center of mass. Use structure parts to center your thrusters around modules being delivered. Each module will need to rendezvous with the space station and then dock. Check the description for help with rendezvous and docking. While installing modules, use Q&E to rotate, and don't hesitate to undock, rotate and redock, or move a module after an initial docking. Thanks for watching. Join me next time for 5 Tips with Combined Spacecraft.